What's going on guys? Danny with Lanier Lawn Care and today we're going to talk about the new uh, light from Milwaukee but you know if you enjoyed this 2135 with the 3000 lumens, the battery charger, things of that nature, well honestly you can say goodbye to that and uh, there is a new boss or king of the block in town now and let me tell you what this new 2136-20 guys is what it's going to be all about so stay tuned we're going to get into this show you what's new what's updated and tell you some about these awesome features this thing has When it comes to tower lights, Milwaukee has been in the game for quite a while. And behind me, we've got their 2131-20. This is their 2135, and then we have the 2136. Now, this is the uh, kit. So this is the 2136-21. So I'm gonna tell you uh, the run test I've got with an 8.0 battery, real-time testing, we're going to go over a lot of stuff about this. So anything, everything you could possibly probably want to know about this bag or the light, we're going to probably cover in this video. Pull this light out of the case. Uh, we will talk about this case later on, but I know most of y'all are here for the light. So let's pull this thing out. If you thought the 2135 was awesome with its 3000 lumens and its fancy LEDs and stuff, you're gonna absolutely love this 2136 because this thing is 6,000 lumens and it is pure, just upgraded completely from the 2135 without the price upgrade. All right, so starting at the bottom here, we have our charger uh, that will charge your batteries. So if your battery's in here, um, you can take and you can plug in so it does have a plug in and you can plug this in and you can use this light with or without a battery uh, you can put your battery in there now this I know y'all are wanting to know this will take your 12 amp hour battery very easily so no issues with that whatsoever but it is going to add about three pounds to this already 21 pound light uh, now this is a couple pounds heavier than the previous generation, the first gen, but it is so much beefier. It's just totally beefed up. Uh, one of them being this long uh, metal handle now, which is honestly great because the older gen had the handle that was kind of small and it really wasn't well balanced. So now, no matter whether you've got a battery in here or not, you can grab this thing, pick it up, and pretty much have your balance point uh, wherever you want it. So no more worries about that. This thing is totally awesome. So uh, then down here, you also have where it tells you the charger part. This is going to tell you what your charging is. So if you've got your battery plugged in here and you've got it plugged in to a wall outlet, then it honestly has your lights here just like your regular charger is going to be. Now this is a regular charger. It puts out the three amps. So this is not a fast charger. Uh, it's just a regular charger. So once again, uh, it's, it's going to take about two and a half hours to charge your eight amp hour battery if you got the kit. So be prepared for that. All right, moving on to the handle. The handle they have added to this is totally awesome. This is very nice gripped. So regardless of whether you got gloves on or anything, this is gonna grip real nice. This is a real nice metal. You can pick it up, it's very well balanced. So now, once again, if you've got a battery in there, you can, you can pick this up and just pretty much figure out where your balance point is and just grab it and go. Uh, you don't have to just grab it here and it'd be awkward carrying it, you know, weird like this. Now it is totally just way better. So they have changed the, the uh, way you open this. It does have beefier legs now as well. So the way you open this now is there's a spot on both sides here 
there's a latch and you pull that latch and you know once again five second setup just like the previous models but this is just god so so different yet so much better now the handle slides along this part of your big handle another thing about this light is we'll, we'll show you um but it is shorter than the 2135 the previous gen but it is also wider so it's about a, a little over an inch wider about an inch and a quarter or so uh wider all around but it's also about an inch and a quarter shorter as well so they just they beefed this thing totally up just absolutely massive all right so this is probably the most awesome feature about this and once you drop this down and put this down you can take your phone because now we have a usb 2.1 charging port to charge your phone tablet things of that nature plug your phone in set it down in there and it'll hold your phone while it charges so how this works is you plug your phone whatever in to this 2.1 charging port and then there's a switch right here on the right side you press that and it will charge for two hours after two hours it automatically shuts off to preserve battery of your battery or whatever uh, so you will have to re engage that or, or you know turn that back on in order to charge longer than that if you needed to but i'm going to tell you two hours uh it's probably going to charge your phone up because once again this 2.1 charger is right around in between the charging of a regular charger and what a phone fast charger would be uh, uh 18 watts this is putting out a little over 11 watts so you're going to get faster charging than a regular charger is going to do but not quite as fast as a fast charger so you know your phone's going to charge within two hours with this usb 2.1 moving on we have our light okay this is our pretty much where it tells us everything um so we're just going to show you an overlay of this and while i talk about it so all of these lights are white and i really like that because the previous model they were red i love this white part so we've got our white part It'll tell us when we're plugged in or if we're on battery power. Uh, as you can tell, we are on battery power, so the battery is lit up. If we were plugged in, then the AC plug would be lit up. Then we have our modes from low to high. And let's say you turn this light off while it's on low, then once you go to turn this light back on, it will automatically default to that low setting that you were using previously. So whatever setting you were using when it shut off is the setting it is going to default back to when you turn it back on. Now to the moment we've all been waiting for the LED part of this. I really, let, let's just show you this. So this is the awesome thing. So how big these LEDs are, I really like the previous model, the LED stuck straight up. So it was hard to keep them uh, from getting scratched or broke or things of that nature. Now they have hid these behind a guard. So these have a guard now, so you can hide them. I just, I think that is totally awesome. Like Milwaukee, you totally knocked this light out of the park when it came listening to the end user of this. You pretty much gave them everything they asked for. So uh, another thing you can do is you can turn these so you can have them off to the side as well. So when you turn them on, then ta-da, let me get that away from you so you don't get blinded by this thing. Um, so now you've got your lights that are, you know, totally just pointing out to the side, which is, I mean, phenomenal. So now you don't have to pull this out if you don't want to, you could just use it like this, but you can pull it out. And these are, so this is even on low, that's low, medium, high this thing is bright okay totally bright so uh, let's pull this up a little bit okay just enough to to show you this so once again you can you can adjust these either which way you want um so the most awesome thing about this light is now you have um you still have the ominal directional uh lights here let's close this so you still have the ominal direction omna uh, omni directional lights multi-directional let's say so you could you could put this however you want and this is nice because now 
it takes a lot of the shadowing away that you would possibly have if you're doing something like this and you've got that spot that's got a shadow. Well now you can bring these lights together and eliminate that shadow completely. So you don't have to worry about it. Now this is still Milwaukee's True View LED lighting that they say. This is a 4000K. So I don't know if you can see this or not. Hopefully you can. Uh, but this, I'm gonna just put on the screen real quick. This shows you the difference so we got our 2700K, which is a warm white, 3000K, soft white, 4000K, which is what Milwaukee says their true view LEDs are. Uh, and then you've got the brighter 5000K, which is a wider white. So the 4000K is right in between that white and yellowish, but it's, you know, it's, it's white. Um, so I really like everything about this light. Extended, you're gonna get a four foot to seven foot. So this is the four foot. If you had these turned, then you can extend this all the way up to seven foot. High output lumens, you're gonna get 6,000 on the high. You're gonna get 3,200 on the medium setting and you're gonna get 1,700 on the low setting. Uh, run time, I only tested run time with the 8.0 amp hour battery and the reason I did that was that's what comes with the kit so I figured that's what if people are going to buy the kit then let me test the runtime of what you're actually buying uh, with an 8.0 high output battery on high I got three hours and 50 minutes so you can expect right around that three hour 50 minute mark with a 8.0 high output battery medium setting i got five hours and 24 minutes with medium so i did not test low an ip54 uh, dust and waterproof rating uh, it's got five year warranty and they say or claim that the leds never have to be replaced on this the leds come with a limited lifetime warranty but you do get a five year tool warranty with this as well now this kit is 5.99 with the kit, you get the light, the bag, and uh, you get the 8.0 high output battery. Now we're gonna go over this bag and tell you a little bit about it in closing. Uh, and then I wanna know your comments down below. What would you like to know about this light? Did I miss anything? If I did, please let me know. Now the kit, I've only found a couple places that you can pre-order this kit uh, or that have it, I'm sorry, that have it in stock uh, CPO Milwaukee, I believe it was, and, and uh, Acme Tools have this. So if you don't want the 8.0 and you're looking for just to add the bag, the case, you're looking at an extra $99 for that. But there's only a couple places that even have it. You can pre-order it. Uh, it's not even available. You, you pre-order it, but it's through Acme and like Toolnut. Uh, you can pre-order. They say they're going to ship later on in this month of November. But the light only you can get for $3.99. That is great. They literally gave you way more than the previous model for the exact same price. And I'm stoked. I'm stoked. I don't know if you're stoked, but I'm stoked. So let's move the light out of the way and let's get into this case. This thing is totally awesome. Okay, this is, this is very nicely padded and when i say very nicely this is a pretty thick pad um, it is very nicely padded it is very oh my god it's just the case is gorgeous guys it's absolutely gorgeous i mean look at the inside of this thing this thing is awesome okay so let's talk a little bit about this do you want the case i'm going to sell you the case so let's go over what this case is so this case is compatible it's compatible with all three of these lights now on the website they say it's only compatible with the new 2136 which is what we just went over and the 2131 but if you notice the 2135 is a little taller okay the 2135 will fit if you want to buy this case for your 2135 i have it it will fit in this case with no issues this case is made out of 1680d ballistic material for you that don't know what that means, because I didn't have a clue neither, I'm gonna let you know, because I did the research on it. So this is a super tough, 
pretty much basket weave synthetic. It's a two by two strong weave. Um, some of the things you would use this for, I guess, is uh, they use it for luggage. They use it for canoe and uh, kayak covers, uh, motorcycle jackets, belts, uh, tool belts, police belts, um, things of that nature. So this is a very, very highly abrasive impact fabric. So you're not gonna have to worry about anything with this bag. And I mean, this thing can just handle the beating and keep on going. So is it worth $100? Oh my God. Do I even need to answer that? It is definitely worth the extra $100 to get this bag for storage. It is uh, also water repellent. Um, I mean, you have no worries with this bag. This thing is just totally awesome. And it, it may be awkward putting your light in here at first, I'm going to tell you, it's, it's awkward. Uh, because the way it sets, it sets at an angle, which is just, I, I don't know. That's the, the awkward part about it, I guess. <clears throat> we'll put it in here for you, show you. Um, it took me a minute to get used to this. Uh, now this is with a battery on it as well. So, I mean, this is going to work with your battery. And they give you extra storage on this. So you can, fit a battery in here if you wanted to, possibly a, a smaller power tool. So, I mean, this will hold more than just this light, but is that what you're gonna use it for? Uh, maybe, maybe not. You know, certain people may. <clears throat> it really just depends. All right, so we're gonna zip this bad boy up. Zip it up, zip it up. I mean, it really, the light just sets in there the way it's supposed to go. It's just, what makes it awkward, I guess, is it zips from the full front side and it goes around and you know, here's the front and it zips and when it zips, it zips around to the back side. So uh, that's just what makes it awkward. I guess. But you've still got, it. I mean, I've still got plenty of room. There's the handles right here. So, I mean, you still got plenty of room on this to do whatever. Then you've got a handle, you've got your carrying handle here. You've got a handle at the bottom. You've got a handle here. And then you've also got hook loops on each end so that you can take your strap that comes with this and click it into place. And you can also carry this with your strap as well. The kit, $5.99, tool only, $3.99, five-year warranty. So let me know your comments down below. What do you think of this thing? If I missed anything, let me know. I'm sure I did because I get so excited to do these things. Uh, but, and I'll answer it to the best of my knowledge. If I don't honestly know, I'll ask and I will let you know. So uh, thanks for watching guys. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. I'm Danny and I will see you in the next video. So y'all have a good one. Stay safe out there and we'll get you a light.